What's up, YouTube fam? It's your boy Chuck McGruff. I'm back with another episode of the Texas Southern Build Dynasty. No rebuild, man. We're going to build this program up like we always say, man. Coming off a loss in last game against Arkansas Pine Bluff, man. We were able to take those guys. First game of the season against them in the conference at our place. We were able to take them out by a substantial amount. The next time we met these guys was the last game. We went to their arena. We were there close neck to neck. But you can see there they beat us out by four points. Conference on players giving us a little more than what we thought we were going to get, man. But this week we ready to get into this Grambling State game. Never went up against this team. Man, they supposed to be pretty decent in the conference. And I'm thinking, man, we got to get some more dubs in the conference to get that top seed in the tournament we need to get a top seed in the tournament so we do not have to face the best of the best so early man but we're gonna go into this game and i hope you guys enjoying the series hit that like and subscribe button you already know that notification bell and let's get it baby we ready let's go all right so you know what time it is baby we here we back in houston man you know when we home, man. We in front of our fans. We got to give them a great show. We going up against Gravelin State. You can see Kit Hampton at center. He's going to be on the star watch. And you know we got our young boy Royer down there. He's going to have to do some work to keep that guy off of the board so often. And you can see us 11-4, 2-2 two in the conference, baby. We ready to get at it. So we're going to set the tempo. We're going to try to get this thing started. And we ready to go, man. This conference play is underway. And, man, we well on our way and trying to get into this conference tournament. Let's go. All right, so tip off, they won it. So we're going to come in, man. We're going to play man. Last game, we started off in the 2-3. And it didn't work out too well for us. Oh, man, he caught us slipping there. That was a smart play. All right, so my boy, Butler in the corner. Can you fire one off early? Not able to. Let's go, man. Took a quick shot there. And we're going to try to keep it going. I think we might be able to run man this whole game against these guys. Looking like it's more of an inside team than anything. Maybe the 2-3. Maybe. We're going to see. If we do, we'll adjust it later. All right, so they they trying to find something at the top. Real slower paced team. I haven't really looked at their um, you know, the tempo for this team. Oh man, he took it through the double team and got the basket. All right, so it's gonna we're gonna try to keep this pace, you know, on our side on how we like to do things. These half court teams very efficient. Don't make too many bad, you know passes or plays because they take their time oh man like i say big kid number 34 how tall is he he got to be standing at seven foot tall all right so i see my boy butley in the corner not not enough time there with him so i do have my boy gilliam right there oh nice drop step can you bank that one good shot baby we ready all right a few little substitutions here we're able to you know keep the big center in check so far don't know how long we, we're going to be able to do that, but we're going to try our best. That's out of bounds. Good way to get that double team and push them out of bounds. Defensively, we're going to have to step up to the plate. We cannot allow 80-plus points this game. we got to keep them in the sixes if we're trying to get a W. All right, so we up at the top of the key. There we go. I got my boy Butley there. Looking for him on that three off this screen here if we can get him. And he's there. Oh, no, it's a mid-range, so we'll take it. Big homie almost blocked that one. <laughs> You can see Grambling State running that motion, old man. That motion offense. Able to get a couple passes down in the paint, catching us slipping. We, you know, we used to. Teams taking that fadeaway jumper down in the low post, but man, they, they waiting on you to bite and they going up and under. Let's go. So a little couple substitutions here. My boy Buckley out of it. Oh, we were there for the steal. But not able to get our hands on it. So watch the low post here. He pulls a three and he misses that one. Oh, and then look at big Kit Hampton. Able to put it back on the tip. Man. He's going to be cleaning the glass. You know we're not going to have much chance. You can see right there they got us by three to get them boys, man. So we got to get, we got to make a lot of shots. All right, good steal there. Now we got to push it, baby. Let's go. I see, I see you, guy. Why you slow down? Why you stop? Oh, nice pass and big jam there. Put it on top of Kit Hampton, baby. Let's go. Oh, 
Up by seven, man. Up by seven. That boy Gilliam having a big night so far. Big night. All right, so they got it. They took, they took Kid out. Let's see what they got down bottom now. A little small lineup for these guys. A big, you know, look like some big power guys down there. All right, so he going to, ooh. Now get it out of there, boy. Where you going with it? Oh, that was a nice move he put on my boy McPherson. Young player on D. You know, he he's going to get beat sometime. But good way to help him out there, Gilliam. And get that foul. All right, so my boy Fleming coming in for McPherson. As we see, they got a mismatch. And they took Big Gaskins out. They must be put Big Kit back in. So check us out, baby. Leon Gilliam, baby. Big night, big night. Fade away. Drain him. And he knocking him down. Pulling up. Hitting bank shots. All right, and catching him in there, and he know he is down there getting it in. So you know the the we don't have to keep explaining that you know our disadvantage. Oh man, bad pass in the middle of the paint. Should have did a move. We don't have to keep explaining our disadvantage, man. You know, we only got three guys on the bench over there, man. The, some of the best bench players in the conference, in my opinion. Oh, nice way to pull it up and knock it down. They're coming back for us, baby. All right, get back up top. Look a big kick. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> and he draw the foul. I didn't know he was going in with the finger roll. He, I said, holy crap, look at that. <laughs> He was going in. It took like three steps to get all the way to the basket. So he only, he's not a big offensive threat I can see. Mostly on the defensive side of the ball. Averaging 10 plus. Boards, man, I believe he can do more than that. Oh, nice move, boy. That's what I'm talking about, Calhoun. We got to take advantage of that one, man. Especially when we got the mismatch. There we go. All right, double team. We up here. Let's go. Double team. There we go. We got to get back to him. He trying to push it. He trying to push it. There we go. We got him. And that's back court. Come on. We got him. We got him acting crazy. Let's go. Should have been back court. Oh, he pulls the three. No, sir. You ain't getting that. We ain't going to let you get that off on us. What you want to do? Ooh-wee, look at the move. He didn't know he was stuck in place right there. Oh, steal? Almost had it, baby. Almost had it. We on top of him. They don't know what to do. <laughs> look at that. My boy Roy going crazy. My boy Gilliam going crazy. Boy, that low post, they coming alive today, baby. Coming to, coming alive. I'm surprised against that big twin, <laughs> that big tower down there, big skyscraper. <laughs> We sitting in the sixth place, y'all. Sitting in the sixth place. Gravel in the eighth place, man. Top is Arkansas Pine Bluff, man. We went against those guys two times already. And they beat us the second time. And they're at the top of the conference. Oh, that's a defensive foul, at least. I almost had me there. And Butley, can you drain one? All the time, baby. Put us up by 12 before the half. And let's go. Double team. Double team. There we go. Yes, sir. They call timeout because they don't know what to do about it. At home, baby, we <laughs> we are hard to beat at home, man. We are. All right, so I got my boy Flim right here. Let's go. Oh, man, I thought you were going to the plate. Oh, man, I didn't even pay attention to the clock, y'all. But we going into the half with a 12-point lead. Man, we were looking good. Look at those passes. That big dunk by my boy, Roy. You put it on top of that boy. Let's go. And they were able to get a couple baskets as well, man. I think they scoring, you know, about average of what they used to score in a half. But we overscored. We, uh, you know, we beat, outbeat our expectations in the first half. <laughs> And uh, we got to continue with this hot streak we got, man. So, you know, we don't have any fast break points, and I'm surprised. But a lot of steals, seven, baby. And the only person in foul trouble is Gilliam. We can't afford, you know, to get multiple players in foul trouble. Maybe one, but not two, man, because our death start the shows after that. All right, so we back with it, baby. Leading scores, Braxton with eight and Gilliam with ten. 
Oh man, big steal though. They're trying to they're trying to set us up. They're trying to set us up. Alright, so see what we got here. Oh man, they they coming a little aggressive here early. Forcing us to, you know, take some some crazy shots like just now. That was a a long shot there. But man. You gotta hit those for them. We up by eleven though. We can cruise. Almost had a steal. Oh, we did get a steal. And go with your move. Nice move there by my boy Royal, man. Okay, so he's dribbling. He's going. Uh-uh. Can we get another one? And look who's there. Buckley, Mr. Can I get one dunk per game, baby? Let's go. Nice way to get your hands in the passing lane. Let's blow this lead, baby. Let's blow it up. All right. We And nice alley there from a boy Flem to Calhoun. And I, he reversed that thing, baby. Let's go. And go for Go with it. Go with your move. Oh. All right. We got it. We got it, baby. We got it. We got it. Get it to Gilliam then since he don't want to do nothing with it. Give it to Buckley. A nice move from Royal. <laughs> a little mismatch there. Able to get that one up. And they struggle from the line all game. And that's one thing about college ball, man. Young players and you no know, hostile environments, man. They're going to struggle in these environments no matter where. Nice alley and nice way to put it in. <laughs> <laughs> They're gonna struggle in these hostile environments, man. Shooting free throws, man. That's one thing about college ball. Those fans get to these guys. They're not pros yet. And he pulls the three. Not able to knock it down. They got the rebound. And my boy Gilliam foul out here. 16 points. He's been playing hard for the whole game. And man, he been getting it in. And we still throwing alleys. It's a lob fest. <laughs> There's a lot of fans out here, baby. All right, so we got him. What you going to do with it? What you going to do with it? Go with it. Not able to drain that one. Now, let's go, God. I want to get you a highlight. Oh, no, not a highlight. <laughs> so for somebody else, maybe. <laughs> And that'll be like an automatic bid. So what we got here, baby, is the last few seconds here. And, baby, chunk it up. We we going to take this one. And, man, we beat them by 20, man. These guys wanted to win this game. As you can see, player of the game. Oh, my boy Godfrey player of the game. He must be was close to, you know, about nine rebounds. He did his thing on the defensive end also. So you see my boys there, man. We had a great game. Wonderful. Man, and we appreciate you guys for watching this video. It's your boy, Coach McGruff, Chuck McGruff, whatever you want to call me, man. Wonderful game for my boys here at Texas Southern, man. We got that victory, and you know what it I say, bro. Hit that like and subscribe button, and holla at your boy. Hunter, I shoot. Let's go.